Welcome to Global Report News, I'm Bob Merrigan. Vital Tibu of Canada stopped going to school by the time he was a 10 year old. By the age of 14, he was working in mechanics, impressing employers with his technical know-how. As an adult, he served as the head of the New Brunswick Trappers Association and even patented a humane animal trap. When he retired, he wanted a hobby, so he opened a fish hatchery. The hatchery would earn the now 85-year-old man millions of dollars. Mr. Tibu did all of this despite never learning how to read or write. And now, as CBC reports, with the help of speech software, he has published his autobiography. Mr. Tibu didn't let his lack of a formal education prevent him from leading a fruitful life. He told the CBC, there's no such thing as can't, as far as I'm concerned, and that's the way I work. I don't take no for an answer and keep on trucking. Friends told him that he had an amazing life story, but it was an episode of Opera's old talk show that inspired him to go forth with a book about his experience. Thus began a six year process. Mr. Tibu had to learn how to operate a computer and then he had to learn how to use the dictation software. It wasn't easy for the computer to understand what he was saying as he has a noticeable Acadian accent. He told the CBC that, uh, that one day it took him two hours to get a single word across. The hard work paid off and now he has finally published his autobiography. A message for you, Mr. Tibu says, to me it is the biggest adventure I ever got into. Thank you for watching Global Report News.